Up in. I'll, I'll hang out all day doing whatever else. No cost. As soon as I step in the record store, boom, 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 boom. I can never just dig in peace. My parents, you know, they they bought me um, the, like my Fisher Price, my first record player, and that was actually how I got my DJ name haircut. Was when they would take me to get a haircut, I'd have a temper tantrum every time. Like, I just couldn't stand it for some reason. And the only way they could get me to shut up was they'd buy me records. They'd buy me a little 45s to like, keep me occupied. All time classic. Delphonics. La La means I love you. Super slept on. Earth, Wind, and Fire. Getaway 45. The key is that it has the instrumental on the flip. See this? 99 cents is a steal. For, yeah, you look for like names on there that you might know. You look for instrumentation, you know. You look for label, you know, labels says a whole lot. Used to really take all these Motown and Gordy and Tamla records like for granted, you know. And now it's funny how like I I just dig for for those really hard now. Just growing up in Detroit, like you know, there are a dime a dozen out there. And you know, you'll flip through a stack of records in, in the D and it's like, you know, eight out of ten of them will be Motown or Tamler or Gordy or VIP or, you know, one of those. And then I got really into hip hop too and, you know, would dig for all the samples from all my favorite hip hop records. You know, cats like Pete Rock and Premier and... <laughs> And uh, Diamond D and Showbiz, and I'd want to find all this dope samples that they used, and that was, you know, most of that stuff was like ill soul music. Every time I see this record, I want to buy it anyway, even though I already have like three copies of it. I just want to buy it every time I see it. There's a couple records like that, and it's not rare, it's just incredible. <laughs> I mean, there's a reason that. You know, common records are common. Yeah. It's because they're the shit, you know. Everybody loved them, so that's why you can find them. Same thing with this Supremes. Everybody knows this someday will be together. That was the big hit. But the flip of this is Sonny Boy. It's like one of the greatest Motown songs of all time. Like if I don't if I don't dig for a couple days, like, get that itch, and like, you just have to, you have to do this, it's like, it's this, it's this motion, it's like habitual, it's terrible, it's like, getting, getting addicted to record digging is, it's like just as bad as any other drug out there, I mean, it's a little healthier for you, but. I mean, it's, not, those finger muscles or it's not healthy for your wallet though. That when I, whenever I I got this dream like that whenever I walk in a room full of people that the intro to Tyrone Davis in the mood kicks in and it's like it'd be like the perfect entrance. <laughs> You know, with the blazing horns. It's just like, hey, Mayor Hawthorne's in the building.